Hi everyone and welcome to my home here in Northern California and welcome to The Real Women of Philadelphia. My name is Mindy Hilton and I'm so excited because we are going to be cooking up some terrific cheesy breadsticks today. And you know what? There's a reason why they always bring a bowl of bread out to the table at these great restaurants that we all love because everyone loves bread and the only thing that's better than breadsticks is cheesy breadsticks. And you know what? These I think are going to be over the top because not only are we going to be using that terrific Philadelphia chive and onion cream cheese by Kraft, we're also going to be using some Italian five cheese blend by Kraft and their new sandwich shop garlic and herb mayo. We're going to mix the cream cheese and the mayo together and we're going to use it to coat our breadsticks and then we're going to toss them in that terrific Italian blend of cheeses. Then we're going to bake them up and in about 10 minutes we are going to have a terrific appetizer that we could use any day of the week. So let's get well, cooking. Today I'm using that Philadelphia chive and onion, but you could really use any variety that you like of the cream cheese by Kraft. And you know what? I've let that get to room temperature, so it's going to be easy to mix with our mayonnaise and it's going to coat our breadsticks perfectly. And I'm just using four ounces of that chive and onion, and now I'm going to use a quarter cup of that flavored mayonnaise. And we're going to just stir this together. And because I let that cream cheese get to room temperature, it's going to mix really easily. And now I've already opened my can of breadsticks. And we've got a dozen breadsticks here. And I would say that's going to serve, depending on everyone's appetite, between 6 and 12 people. And we're just going to toss these in to our bowl. And we're going to coat them with that great mixture. And you know what? I've got these sitting on a lined cookie sheet and I'm going to bake these up on two small cookie sheets that I've lined with foil and sprayed with a butter flavored nonstick spray just for easy cleanup. I'm all about easy. And you know what? If I had my kids home with me today, this is something I would let them help out because they're going to enjoy getting their fingers dirty and coating those breadsticks with that um, cream cheese and mayonnaise and then they're going to have fun tossing them in with the shredded cheese. So pull your kids into the kitchen with you because this is a perfect recipe for them to help out. All I'm doing is playing with my food. It feels like it anyways, but no really. All I'm doing is mixing up that breadstick dough with Kraft's wonderful Philadelphia chive and onion cream cheese and Kraft's sandwich shop mayo garlic and herb. After I get this all mixed up and have that breadstick dough all nice and coated, all I'm gonna do is toss it into that shredded cheese. Well I'm down to my last one and you know what? That two cups of shredded cheese was the perfect amount to coat our breadsticks. And you know what? The kids, I wish they were here. They would love these. They look like hairy little caterpillars, but they're going to taste, I'm sure, a lot better than a caterpillar would. Not that I have ever tasted a caterpillar, but these are going to be fabulous with all of that craft goodness. And you know what? I'm going to put these in the oven at 375 degrees that I've preheated. And in 10 minutes, we are going to have an amazing appetizer. Well, I will tell you, it smells amazing in here, thanks to that Philadelphia chive and onion cream cheese and that Kraft sandwich shop mayo. Oh my goodness, these breadsticks are going to be out of this world. I think these are about the cheesiest breadsticks I've ever seen, and that's a good thing. And you know what? You can serve them just out of the oven if you like. They're also going to be great at room temperature, which I love. I love things that I can prepare ahead of time and not have to worry about being in the kitchen when I'm trying to entertain guests. And you know what? You could serve them with some fresh chopped chives or some a sprinkling of fresh parsley, which is what I've done. And you know what? These are going to be amazing. I can't wait to take a bite. What's not to love? Bread, cheese, you've got the flavors from all those chive and onions and the herbs. It's amazing. You know, I I know this was so easy. Don't think easy doesn't have to be fabulous because this is out of this world. I hope you'll give it a try. And until next time, it's been a blast. Bye everyone.